Hey everybody, this is RC Makeover, and today I'm bringing to you my Armor Granite that I converted to the Armor Outcast 4S. Now, the reason why I converted my Armor Granite to the Outcast 4S is because I once had an Armor Outcast 4S, and I ended up selling it at one of the RC swap meets, and I regret it. I can no longer find any Armor Outcast 4S anywhere. I looked all over for them, they're all sold out, and I don't think they're in production anymore. So, to make up for that, I went ahead and made my own armor outcast for us and the first steps i did to do that i went ahead and put the armor mega typhoon arms on here and for those you know who have the granite you know that's like the wide kit for the granite you put the armor mega typhoon arms on it and that all you know, from there you know you're good to go that's like a wide kit for it you see the wide wheel base then i also added some of the Doratrex Bandito belted tires on hand. They're 2.8. They're good for bashing. They're good for speed runs. You know, I have no problems on them. And I I like them. I like the look of them as well, too. And from there, I, I added the uh, Armor Outcast body post mounts. And for the body post mounts, you only need to add the front body post mounts. And what you'll do is you'll take out your Armor Granite body post mounts, you know, unscrew them, slide the Armor Outcast Forest body post post mounts right into the same place where the, where the granites were and everything bolts right in it's all universal and you can leave your rear body post mounts from the granite you don't need to change those at all and for the wing I actually added the armor vortex wing onto the body and the reason why I did that was it made it easier for me I don't have to change the willy bar I can actually keep my armor granite 3s willy bar on there so by doing that, I kept the armor vortex wing. And the only other major changes I did from there was, let me remove this body for you. Went ahead and changed out the ESC. I put, instead, I put it to the Spectrum 2 to 4S ESC. And I changed the motor to a 3900 KV motor. And I run this vehicle totally on 4S now. And I also kept the same 0 0.8 mod gearing spur gears in here i just went ahead and made sure i put the metal one in and believe it or not this vehicle is actually a lot faster than my original armor outcast 4s and you know the only other things i'll probably do to it is get rid of the factory those the factory shocks off of here and add on some of the um, you know the big ball all aluminum shocks get rid of these plastic things but as far as for right now, I've been bashing it fine. Haven't had any problems, no breakage. And um, it's a pretty good vehicle. If you have any questions or if you want to turn your armor granite into the armor outcast, um, just leave me a message in the comment section and I can give you the part list. And everything's pretty cheap. You know, you can get the body from off of A-Main Hobbies. It's about $35. You know, and all the other parts, like the little parts, like the plastic wing from the Vortex, or the body post, you know, all that stuff is like two to four dollars, two, four, six, eight dollars, you know, really cheap. And um, if you really want to, you can leave your original electronics in it. But I went ahead and changed the electronics because I really wanted to run it on 4S. So um, that's and for this video. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave a message in the comment section, like I said before. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.